Hello, hope all is well. So uh, these are some updated tests between uh, firmware 7 and firmware 8 beta. As uh, people rightly put in the comments about resetting uh, the amp block, which uh, I thought I'd, I'd gone through, I'd done when before doing those tests, but it turns out on uh, at least, well, two of the presets that I used to test, that wasn't the case. So uh, I redid the tests today after resetting the, um, the amp block. And to do that, you go into presets, manage presets, or this is one way of doing it. You right click on, uh, say, the preset that you're updating, reset amp blocks, and then you close it. It'll update, and then I'll read the presets again, and then all the values will be updated. Or, I mean, all the, all the values of the amp will be properly updated to firmware 8. So I did this with the uh, metal preset that uh, I retested, and I redid it on this preset right here. So you'll hear the first comparison I did in the uh, other video, and you'll hear the last comparison I did in the other video. The second uh, comparison I did, that was with a brand new preset that I made in firmware 8. And what I did there was sort of like reverse engineer. Um, so I made a new preset in firmware 8, and then I updated the amp page um, values to match uh, or closely match, uh, given the value was there, the amp page values from firmware 7. So I'll leave that video up as I put the uh, firmware 7 amp values in there if you want to check those out and, and put those in yourself. So this is just an update of those two tests, the first one and the last one. So let's have a listen again. Thank you. 
the thing here with the updated tests, uh, you could still hear that um, while perhaps not as, uh, as muddy as uh, in the, the previous video tests, it's definitely darker. Uh, and the voicing is somewhat different. You know, it's, there's more beef or bass or chunk, uh, however you want to call it. Uh, there's less high-end extension. And um, yeah, there's, there's something in the voicing, at least in the mids, uh, that is just, uh, that's just different, I think. Uh, and I'll still be doing tests and I'll see what I can come up with or how I can tweak things uh, better, but there is certainly a difference. The, the last thing I'll add here, as I think this will be an, an ongoing uh, couple of videos, I think, because I'll still be testing it uh, with the real amp as well, is that I made a thread in the um, in the wish uh, list portion of the Fractal Forum, and I'll put that up as well. As, um, yeah, listening back, and uh, I'll do more tests, but I think, uh, or at least I feel there's enough of a difference between the two models uh, that would be extremely cool. Um, that Mark I would still be in the firmware in a future update so that you have access to both amps depending on what you want to use. And that would be absolutely incredible. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll see how that goes. Uh, thanks for checking out this update. Comments as always, definitely welcome. Thanks for checking it out. Take care.